Doc's World. If you'd like, we can change the walls and floor. What do you think? When Rudy picked you up, Hermie, he snapped off one of your claws. Huh. We have a diagnosis: clobigonitis. Don't worry, I think we can fix this. <laughs> Will you help snap Hermie's claw back into place? You can do it. Just put Hermie's great job. Hermie looks as good as new. But I think we better help him get his strength back in that claw. It's time for some physical therapy. Herm. Keep going. Hermie's claw is almost back to full yeah. strength. Wow, you're a natural. Okay. Let's test his strength by seeing if he can break pencils. To see how strong you helped make him, touch Hermie's claw. Wow! Yeah. Did you see that? Hermie's really strong now, and it's all thanks to you. Let's add this to your big book of boo boos. Congratulations on solving the case. You're a really good toy doctor. Hermie wanted you to have these. More happy hearts. You really earned them. Thanks again for helping out at the clinic. You're a really good friend. You can choose anything you'd like, as long as you have enough happy hearts to get it. See? Look at all the things you can get. More posters, more outfits, more songs, all kinds of stuff. Pretty cool, huh? Hermie. Oh. When Rudy picked you up, Hermie, he snapped off one of your claws. Huh. We have a diagnosis: clobigonitis. Don't worry, I think we can fix this. <laughs> Will you help snap Hermie's claw back into place? Yeah. Great job! Hermie looks as good as new. But I think we better help him get his strength back in that claw. It's time for some physical therapy. Hermie needs to raise his claw up and down. Would you show him how? Keep going. Hermie's claw is almost back to full strength. Yeah.
Wow, you're a natural. Okay, let's test his strength by seeing if he can break pencils. To see how strong you helped make him, touch Hermes' claw. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, yeah. did you see that? Hermes really strong now, and it's all thanks to you. Thanks for helping Hermie get his claw back on and practice his physical therapy. For all that, you get the Sports Doctor Badge. Come on, let's go see if any other toys need our help. Hermie wanted you to have these. More happy hearts! You really earned them. This is my garden. Let's look around and see if we can find any toys. Let's make sure we listen for Wilbur and Orville. They should be landing here soon. Wow, that was really fun. And look, you got some happy hearts. <laughs> There's Bronte. I wonder how he's feeling. I'm ready, Doc. Uh-oh. I think Bobby's got a boo-boo. We should see what's wrong. Let's give you a checkup. <gasps> Your breath is pretty stinky, Bronte. <gasps> it looks like you've got something stuck in your teeth. It's a piece of salami. We have a diagnosis. Stinky salami breath. If we take out that salami and brush your teeth, your breath should smell a lot better. Bronte, you'll need to open your mouth. Hmm. Maybe if you rubbed his head a little, he'd feel more comfortable. <laughs> Great job! Can you help me get the salami out of Bronte's teeth? Just use the tweezers to pick out the pieces. Hold. Ick! Your breath's still kind of stinky, Bronte. <laughs> I bet that feels a lot better, Bronte. Great. Now we just need to give those teeth a good brush. Would you help brush Bronte's teeth? Oh, that's so much better. Bronte's going to be the best-smelling dinosaur in the whole garden. <laughs>
Thanks for helping cure Bronte's stinky salami breath. Let's add this to your big book of boo-boos. Congratulations on solving the case. You're a really good toy doctor. I'd say that deserves some happy hearts. Could you check the other parts of the garden? If anyone has a boo-boo, I want to be sure we help them. Wow, that was really fun. And look, you got some happy hearts. Well, how to do, da? Uh-oh, I think Bobby's got a boo-boo. We should see what's wrong. Let's make sure we listen for Wilbur and Orville. They should be landing here soon. <laughs> Uh-oh, it looks like playing with Donnie left Bobby a little deflated. Bull? Poppy, you need a checkup. I think we know what the problem is, Boppy. Since you've been playing near the prickly plants, you have a bad case of the prickle thorns. Boy. We need to find out where Boppy is leaking. Could you help? Just use the magnifying glass to spot the hole and put a bandage on it. <laughs> you found it! Great job! Now that we know where the hole is, we should use a bandage to cover it so he won't leak air. <laughs> oh no! There's another hole! Get a bandage on it quick! <laughs> I think there's one more hole. Can you find it? <laughs> wow, you're a natural. Hmm. Don't forget, Boppy. Be sure to stay away from things that are sharp, like prickly plants. Put this diagnosis in your big book of boo-boos. Congratulations on solving the case. You're a really good toy doctor. And for helping Boppy feel better, you got some happy hearts. You did a great job. I think we fixed all the ouchies here. Do you want to go to the playground now? Let's make sure we listen for Wilbur and Orville. They should be landing here soon. Wow, that was really fun. And look, you got some happy hearts. Give us a giggle, sugar. Would you like a cup of tea? <laughs> 
<laughs> Let's give you a checkup. <gasps> Your breath is pretty stinky, Bronte. <gasps> It looks like you've got something stuck in your teeth. It's a piece of salami. We have a diagnosis. Stinky salami breath. If we take out that salami and brush your teeth, your breath should smell a lot better. Bronte, you'll need to open your mouth. Hmm. Maybe if you rubbed his head a little, he'd feel more comfortable. Mm -mm, mm -mm. <laughs> Great job! Can you help me get the salami out of Bronte's teeth? Just use the tweezers to pick out the pieces. Hold the tweezers steady so you can get a good grip. Nick, your breath's still kind of stinky, Bronte. Nick, your breath's still kind of stinky, Bronte. <laughs> I bet that feels a lot better, Bronte. Great. Now we just need to give those teeth a good brush. So much better. Bronte's going to be the best smelling dinosaur in the whole garden. <laughs> Brushing our teeth is really important. It helps make sure we don't get bad breath and keeps our teeth healthy too. Bronte is so happy, he wants you to have this dentist badge. Dentists are special doctors who help keep our mouths healthy, just like you did for Bronte. Come on, let's go see if any other toys need our help. I'd say that deserves some happy hearts. You did a great job. I think we fixed all the ouchies here. Do you want to go to the playground now? Would you like a cup of tea? <laughs> wow, that was really fun. And look, you got some happy hearts. I'm ready, Doc. Let's make sure we listen for Wilbur and Orville. They should be landing here soon.
looks like playing with Donnie left Bobby a little deflated. Bull? Bobby, you need a checkup. I think we know what the problem is, Bobby. Since you've been playing near the prickly plants, you have a bad case of the prickle thorns. Bull? We need to find out where Bobby is leaking. Could you help? Just use the magnifying glass to spot the hole and put a bandage on it. <laughs> you found it! Great job! Now that we know where the hole is, we should use a bandage to cover it so he won't leak air. <laughs> oh no! There's another hole! Get a bandage on it quick! <laughs> I think there's one more hole. Can you find it? <laughs> wow, you're a natural. Hmm, Bobby still looks a little... You did it! Poppy's all pumped up and ready to play. Whew, that was a close call. But thanks to your great work, you got the emergency rescue badge. Congratulations! Come on! And for helping Bobby feel better, you got some happy hearts! You did a great job. I think we fixed all the ouchies here. Do you want to go to the playground now? Wow, that was really fun. And look, you got some happy hearts. Well, how'd it do, Da? Would you like a cup of tea? <laughs> Let's make sure we listen for Wilbur and Orville. They should be landing here soon. <laughs> I guess we don't need to keep all this stuff. I know. Let's swap it out. This looks so cheerful. I just know our patients are going to love it. What kind of music would you like to listen to? Sounds 
great. Everyone gets hurt sometimes. It's okay to tell. You don't have to hide. Person or dragon, tiny or tall. Sometimes we tumble and sometimes we fall. Everyone gets hurt sometimes. <laughs> that sounds great. I guess we don't need to keep all this stuff. I know. Let's swap it out. You've made this place look amazing. Thanks. Look, you got some more happy hearts. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. Maybe we could give the windows a makeover. Thanks again for helping out at the clinic. You're a really good friend. Are you ready to use more of your happy hearts? Looks like it's makeover time. We've got hats, clothes, glasses, and lots of accessories. Awesome! Awesome! Let's decorate! Thanks again for helping out at the clinic. You're a really good friend. Are you ready to use more of your happy hearts? Awesome. 
Are you ready to use more of your happy hearts? You've forgotten how to read, Professor Hootsberg, but I do think that we should look at your eyes. Ooh. Oh, I know what's wrong. Your glasses are missing. You have glasses gone, Itis. Don't worry, Professor Hootsberg. We'll fix your eyesight in no time. All we need to do is find you the perfect pair of glasses. Ooh. Oops, that's not it. Try again. Oops, that's not it. Try again. Ooh, great job! I think we're getting really close to finding just the right pair. Great job! Professor Hootsberg says the chart is almost clear. Her glasses just need a little more adjustment. There you go, Professor. Problem solved. Now that you have new glasses, you should be able to read just fine. Let's add this to your big book of boo-boos. Congratulations on solving the case. You're a really good toy doctor. Oh! <laughs> and don't forget about your happy hearts. You definitely earned them. My toys love coming here. I wonder who's playing on the playground today. Uh-oh. Professor Hootsberg is looking a bit confused. We better go find out what's wrong. Wow! That was really fun! And look! You got some happy hearts! I hope Lenny's all right. He doesn't seem to have much energy today.
Uh-oh. It sounds like you're out of tune, Zyla. Oh. I'm not sure what's wrong, but I know how we can find out. Oh. Don't worry, Zyla. This won't hurt a bit. Hmm. Some of your keys are loose. Well, we have a diagnosis. Loose key syndrome. Will you help me replace Zyla's loose keys and get her back in tune? Fantastic! Great job! The keys look correct to me, but we should probably test them. Just follow the notes. Now it's your turn. That's it. Pitch perfect. <laughs> Zyla is back in tune. Let's add this to your big book of boo boos. Congratulations on solving the case. You're a really good toy doctor. Look! For fixing Xyla's boo-boo, you got some happy hearts! My toys love coming here. I wonder who's playing on the playground today. Wow! That was really fun! And look! You got some happy hearts! I hope Lenny's all right. He doesn't seem to have much energy today. I wonder why Donnie doesn't want to play with Lenny anymore. I think we need to give him a checkup. Uh oh! It looks like Lenny's out of water. We have a diagnosis dried out atosis. We need to make sure that Lenny has enough water to stay hydrated. To help Lenny fill up, 
Try pouring some water into the glass. Fantastic! You're doing really well. Soon, this toy's gonna be all better. Wow, Lenny must have been really thirsty. I think you're all filled up, Lenny. Are you ready for some firefighting practice? Would you have... <laughs> I'd say Engine 9 is feeling fine. Ah. You're all better, Lenny. Let's get you back to Donnie so you two can play together again. Let's add this to your big book of boo-boos. Congratulations on solving the case. You're a really good toy doctor. For being such a big help at the clinic, I've got some more happy hearts for you. My toys love coming here. I wonder who's playing on the playground today. I think you've forgotten how to read, Professor Hootsberg, but I do think that we should look at your eyes. Ooh. Oh, I know what's wrong. Your glasses are missing. You have glasses gone-itis. Don't worry, Professor Hootsberg. We'll fix your eyesight in no time. All we need to do is find you the perfect pair of glasses. Ooh. Oops, that's not it. Try again. Great job! I think we're getting really close to finding just the right pair. Ooh. Oops, that's not it. Try again. Ooh. Great job! Professor Hootsberg says the chart is almost clear. Her glasses just need a little more adjustment. There you go, Professor. Problem solved. Now that you have new glasses, you should be able to read just fine. Don't forget about your happy hearts. You definitely earn them. Let's see if we have any other patients. A doctor's work is never done, but a doctor's work sure is fun. <laughs> My toys love coming here. I wonder who's playing on the playground today. Wow, that was really fun. And look, you've got some happy hearts.
why Donnie doesn't want to play with Lenny anymore. Uh-oh! It looks like Lenny's out of water. We have a diagnosis. Dried out atosis. We need to make sure that Lenny has enough water to stay hydrated. To help Lenny fill up, try pouring some water into the glass. You're almost done. Fantastic! You're doing really well. Soon, this toy's gonna be all better. You're almost done. Wow, Lenny must have been really thirsty. I think you're all filled up, Lenny. Are you ready for some firefighting practice? Would you? <laughs> I'd say Engine 9 is feeling fine. <sighs> when you're playing, it's important to drink lots of water so you don't get dehydrated, especially on hot days. You made Lenny feel so much better, he asked me to give you this nutritionist badge. For being such a big help at the clinic, I've got some more happy hearts for you! My toys love coming here. I wonder who's playing on the playground today. Wow! That was really fun! And look! You got some happy hearts! Uh-oh, it sounds like you're out of tune, Zyla. I'm not sure what's wrong, but I know how we can find out. Oh. Don't worry, Zyla. This won't hurt a bit. Hmm, some of your keys are loose. Well, we have a diagnosis. Loose key syndrome. Will you help me replace Zyla's loose keys and get her back in tune? Great job! Those keys look right, but we should test them out. Try playing a tune. Now it's your turn!
That sounded really good. You can go again or just play your own. Pitch perfect. <laughs> Zyla is back in tune. And for being such a great doctor, here's a surgeon badge. Look! For fixing Xyla's boo-boo, you got some happy hearts! My wow! That was really fun! And look! You got some happy hearts! You've forgotten how to read, Professor Hootsberg, but I do think that we should look at your eyes. Oh, I know what's wrong. Your glasses are missing. You have glasses gone-itis. Don't worry, Professor Hootsberg. We'll fix your eyesight in no time. All we need to do is find you the perfect pair of glasses. Ooh, great job! I think we're getting really close to finding just the right pair. Ooh, great job! Professor Hootsberg says the chart is almost clear. Her glasses just need a little more adjustment. Great job! Come on! It's story time for everyone! <music> Professor Hootsberg wants you to have this optometrist badge. Optometrists are special doctors who look after our eyes, just like you did for her. Come on! Oh! <laughs> and don't forget about your happy hearts. You definitely earned them. My toys love coming here. I wonder who's playing on the playground today. My toys love coming here. I wonder who's playing on the playground today. Come on, let's decorate. Now that you're a doctor, let's make sure you look the part. There's lots of cool stuff to choose from. What sort of doctor are you going to look like today? You're doing great. Just mix and match until you find exactly what you want. Looking good. Now, 
Which outfit would you like to wear in the clinic? Your patients are going to love that outfit. You look amazing. I can't wait for everyone in the clinic to see you. You really look like a doctor now. Just mix and match until you find exactly what you want. Look! I made you a name badge. Welcome to the team. This name badge will let all your patients know who you are. So if you're ready, let's go! Surprise! You've earned some happy hearts. When you've got enough, you can use your happy hearts to get more outfits, posters, and songs. If you'd like, we can change the walls and floor. What do you think? That's the big book of boo-boos. After you've helped a toy, you can come back and see a picture of it in the book. I'm so glad you're back. There's always lots to do at the clinic. When you're ready, just grab your ID badge. Or, if you want, you can start over. Come on, let's decorate. Are you ready to choose another outfit? Let's see what else we have for you. What sort of doctor are you going to look like today? You're doing great. Just mix and match until you find exactly what you want. Looking good! This name badge will let all your patients know who you are. So if you're ready, let's go! If you'd like, we can change the walls and floor. What do you think? You've made this place look amazing! Thanks! Maybe we could give the windows a makeover.
Would you like to use your happy hearts to get some more stuff for the clinic? Don't forget your happy hearts. They'll come in handy later. Let's get started. To learn about your doctor's tools, just pick one and then use it to give your helper a checkup. Just choose a doctor's tool and try it out. A stethoscope. We use this to check a patient's heartbeat. Why don't you give it a try? <laughs> That heartbeat sounds good to me. Great work! Now you know how to use the stethoscope. You're really good at using doctor's tools. That deserves some happy hearts. A magnifying glass. We use this to look closely and see if a patient has a scratch or maybe a splinter. Come on! <laughs> Everything looks nice and healthy. Great job using the magnifying glass. You're really good at using doctor's tools. That deserves some happy hearts. A thermometer. This helps check a patient's temperature to see if they have a fever. Just place it near the patient's mouth or under the patient's arm. <laughs> that temperature looks just fine. And now you know how to use a thermometer. Nicely done. You're really good at using doctor's tools. That deserves some happy hearts. A reflex hammer. We use this to check a patient's reflexes. Just give the patient's elbow a teeny tap. <laughs> reflexes look good. I'd say you definitely know how to use a reflex hammer. You're really good at using doctor's tools. That deserves some happy hearts. Hmm. I guess we don't need to keep all this stuff. I know. Let's swap it out. What kind of music would you like to listen to? I've been stuck here inside, just a little old me. Now I gotta get out to see what I can see. Let's play outside. I feel better, so much better. Thank you, Doc, for taking all the options away. Everyone gets hurt sometimes It's okay to tell You don't have to hide Person or dragon Tiny or tall Sometimes we tumble And sometimes we fall Everyone gets hurt sometimes <laughs> That sounds great! If you'd like, we can change the walls and floor. What do you think? Thanks again for helping out at the clinic. You're a really good friend. Hi, 
Are you ready to use more of your happy hearts? That looks great! Awesome! Awesome! That looks great! Are you gonna get it? Awesome! 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 How about we do some decorating?
Wow, you've made this place feel super friendly. Would you like to choose a song to play on the radio? This looks so cheerful. I just know our patients are going to love it. Maybe we could give the windows a makeover. How about we do some decorating? Great doctor's tools. Have you tried all of them yet? Would you like to learn more about your doctor's tools? Great! A stethoscope. We use this to check a patient's heartbeat. Why don't you give it a try? <laughs> that heartbeat sounds good to me. Great work. Now you know how to use the stethoscope. Hmm. I guess we don't need to keep all this stuff. I know. Let's swap it out. Do you want to choose someone else to help you? They're all really excited. Right, guys? Yay! <laughs> Chili really likes to get checkups, so he'll be very helpful as a pretend patient. Wow, Doc. That was amazing. Stuffy loves having adventures. He's a very brave dragon. Let me show you how the dragon does it. Lammy's a wonderful friend, and she gives the best cuddles. Do you need a cuddle? Hallie's a super helpful hippo and a really good nurse. I'm ready, Doc. Chili really likes to get checkups, so he'll be very helpful as a pretend patient. Wow, Doc. That was amazing. Would you like to learn more about your doctor's tools? Great! A stethoscope. We use this to check a patient's heartbeat. Why don't you give it a try? Woo! <laughs> that heartbeat sounds good to me. Great work! Now you know how to use the stethoscope. If you'd like, we can change the walls and floor. What do you think? This is where we make posters for the clinic. You can make one from scratch, or choose one that I've already started and help me finish it.
great choice. I love making posters. Looking good.
Wow, your decorating has made the clinic look really nice. And to say thank you, I've got some more happy hearts just for you. If you'd like, we can change the walls and floor. What do you think?